Hello everyone, uh, back again with another video how-to video on changing the layout of OpenWebRx. This time, as you can see, where I've got this at the very top corner of the header, uh, where it says your kind of call sign, the name of your web SDR and some details, it's greyed out slightly and not very readable. So I want to change that to a different colour, so it's quite straightforward. So we're going to do the same thing again, right click on there and go to inspect. Um, we can do any testing then that we want to do um, within the web browser without actually changing anything first. So um, that should bring straight away, bring up um, the, the details. And as you can see, it's highlighted where we were and that's the, the details. And then on the top right here, it gives you the color. So I'm just going to go in there and change that for now to something else. Um, let's go with FFF, which is white. There you go. That's changed that to white. Uh, you could have that whatever colour you wanted. Um, you could have the usual colour I use is F0, which is the green, which is on a lot of things. So you, we could go with green and then we could see what that looks like. I don't know. Do you think that would go? Green? Mm, maybe. <laughs> anyway, um, that's uh, that's sort of testing it so we know where it is. Um, it's called openwebrx-header.css. So we've got to go and find that um, and uh, basically change it on the system. So log into your OpenWebRx um, machine. Uh, let's go into mine. Then we're going to go into probably the htdocs folder. <clears throat> so I've not actually looked where this is yet. My guess is it's uh, in the CSS, so htdocs, uh, you can see where that is from up here. USR lib python3 dist packages. I'm going to double click on the CSS folder, put the password in for the local machine. Open WebRx header, ah, I reckon it's that. So we're going to open that with a text editor. Yet another password entry. When you're doing this a lot, that does get quite frustrating, that password entry. Right, so this is the list of all the CSS stuff now. Let's go back and double check what it was called. Um, I'm going to click on that, see what it brings up. WebRx-Rx-Texts. Okay, let's see if we can see that in here or even search for it. Web Rx dots web rx dash rx dash text. Um, right, okay. Is it looking better? I think it was that one there, wasn't it? So let's change that to. Um, I'm going to put it white just to be boring to start with. Click save. And then I'm going to go back in here and I'm going to do a control and F5 to reset the browser and kind of clear the cache. Control F5 and then hopefully that should be white now. There we go, it's white. That's it. That's how you do it. That was easy, wasn't it? Um, yeah, cool. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.